If you've been following the tech news recently, you might have seen that WhatsApp has finally added the view once feature when sending photos and videos. With this setting enabled, the person who receives your photo or video will only be able to view it once before it disappears from their phone. If you are wondering whether you can do the same thing in Signal, well, the answer is, of course, yes, you can. To send a photo or video as view once in Signal, click on the camera icon beside the text box. Take your photo or video or pick one from your library. And then in the bottom left hand corner of your screen, click on the little infinity icon, which will change to a number one. It's worth noting that you can't send a message with the media when view once is enabled. So you'll need to send your message separately either before or afterwards. Having sent your photo, the recipient can access it once. After which, if they try and access it again, they'll receive a message saying they've already viewed it. So that is how to use the view once feature in Signal. If you missed my video demonstrating how to prevent apps from tracking you on your iPhone, then I recommend watching this. In iOS, we now have the ability to prevent apps from tracking our location and our online activity. When it comes to location tracking, there are a couple of options. You can choose whether to allow an app to know your precise location based on GPS coordinates, and you can choose whether an app is allowed to track you all of the time, just whilst you're using that app or not at all. You can set these options for each individual app by clicking on the app name in settings. Alternatively, you can disable all apps from knowing your location by clicking on privacy and disabling location services altogether. However, I wouldn't recommend doing this as some apps do have a genuine need for your location, such as navigation, Uber, and some fitness trackers. The other form of tracking is online activity tracking, where an app will log your, the websites you visit, the purchases you make, so on and so forth. Your iPhone will prompt you when an app wants to do this, and as with location, you can turn it off for each individual app. However, in this case, I can't see a good reason for allowing any app to track your internet habits, so I would recommend turning this off for all apps by opening settings, clicking on privacy, followed by tracking, and disabling the option here. So that is how to use the view once feature in Signal and prevent apps from tracking you on your iPhone. If you found the video useful, I'd appreciate you giving me a like and hit subscribe for lots more quick tips like this one. Until next time, thank you very much for watching.